All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21, we got people getting busted for boosting. Joe Knowles says that ankle breakers are bike, and running 2K giving out the logos to all the right people. So make sure that if you don't do anything else, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content. We're dropping the 2K heat every day of the week. And uh, we also got your boy, your boy Eager, a.k.a. Crip walking his back, man. I've been watching him this morning. Dude is the real deal, man. Like, even if people don't want to get off the fact that they feel like he's using the Cronus or something, let me tell you something that, you, that I've been watching him do that you can't teach. You can't teach the movements. You can't teach the IQ. And you definitely can't teach the things in the game when you know that you're open. You can't script those things, man. So, hey. He been on the stage, he been winning in comp stage all morning. He just took out BP and D-Boy. So, I mean, and he played bad games, though, and he still beat him. So, hey, if he's cheating, he's the worst cheater of all time now. I mean, I don't know nothing about before. I ain't got nothing to do with none of that. But I'm telling you that if he was cheating, that was just putting the icing on the cake. Because he is the real deal as far as movement, IQ, and all that stuff. So, hey, it is what it is, man. But anyway, let's get right into the video. Uh, make sure you like it up. And uh, I'm gonna holler at y'all in a second. Nino! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pockets, that shit made me sad. Start hustling non stop, don't plan on breaking that habit. Alright, so check it out, ladies and gentlemen. So yesterday we talked about the game getting, uh, the game wasn't, he didn't get banned yesterday, but Pool DF did get banned. And now we've got confirmation from Ronnie 2K right here. And it says, it just says that the game and pool are both banned for boosting. Now, when you get banned for boosting, you don't get banned for life. Normally it's a seven day ban or, you know, something like that. So they will be back. Power DF comes out and obviously he's going to come out in, in support of his clan mate and say that pool appears online hundred percent of the time. Anyone can join his park at any time and stream and streams pretty much every day. If he was boosting, people would know and i'm just saying to myself but i mean you're not streaming 100 percent of the time though so you know it is what it is um ronnie comes back and says power all due respect you don't you don't have access to the tools 2k does uh let me see they both they both know what they did and like i said they can appeal they can appeal to uh i guess that's customer service i'm telling you what i know not speculation i'm telling you what i know which is which is a dev has video video and tracking both of them um and others who got banned we don't ban without more than enough evidence and that's something that a lot of people always be talking about like you know what what evidence do they got and uh and stuff like that bro i'm telling you 2k if they ban you they're banning you for a reason they got all the information how can you argue with the people that have the information behind the scenes that little stuff petty stuff that y'all got on the front side or that y'all think that bro they have access to the game api okay you got access to the game api they can look and see what somebody's done and if they say okay this is normal this is normal this is normal this is an anomaly and then during these hours this anomaly always occurs or it occurs for this amount of time blah 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 they're gonna look at that and see what happened and, and they got you man like it is what it is like i, I get what you're saying but you can't argue with the devs and the tools that they got. It's just not something that you're going to win. It is what it is. They say you was cheating. They say he was cheating. Then he was cheating. And they he banned for boosting. Like they said, like yesterday we didn't know why he was banned. And they said that he got set up by the game. But bro, very set like people that get caught for stealing, very seldom do you get caught for stealing or anything your very first time. Especially when it's something that's gotta be tracked like this. And then uh power comes back and says, I understand that you guys I understand that you guys have tools in the process, but I think that pool, uh, pool was set up, and I'm asking, I'm asking if you guys can review it. I played hundreds of games with pool. I've played, I've seen him uh, stay up 30 hours straight with no sleep. I can't accept uh, he boosted. I can't accept he boosted because I was there. I was there. I saw his grind. Yeah, but you went there 100% with him. It's just like when people be like, man, that's my brother, man. That's my brother. My brother can't, he couldn't have did this. But are you with your brother 100% of the time, bro? That's all I'm saying. And like we said, if we know for 100% truth that the game was cheating, right? I hate when this thing happened. It does this, this little funny thing with my, there we go. If we know for 100% true that the game was cheating, right? He admitted it. He put it out there. He didn't care. Hashtag ban the game. 
If he was cheating and you're right behind him, then what does that say? How are you keeping up with somebody that's cheating? It's not humanly possible. Just like I said yesterday, Lance Armstrong, people that was, they had to go to like 19th place to find the next person. Let me show y'all something real quick, man. I'm gonna show y'all the 1988 uh, Olympics in Seoul, right? Look, Ben Johnson was accused of cheating and later found that he cheated, right? Let me show y'all something real quick. I'm gonna show y'all this picture. Boom, do you see this picture right here? This is Ben Johnson. This is Carl Lewis that came in second place. You see how close they are to Carl Lewis? You see how far ahead of everybody else Ben Johnson is? It's not even close. If y'all don't know, let me show y'all another picture off of Reddit. Boom! Do you see that everybody else is step for mother freaking step with Carl Lewis? And Ben Johnson is literally two meters ahead of them? Do y'all see this? So if somebody's cheating, and you're right by the person that's cheating. What's that saying about y'all? Y'all don't believe me again? Look, man, home run race 1998. Look at this information that we have. Y'all probably can't see it. Let me blow it up some for y'all, man. Look at this. Mark McGuire, 70 home runs. Right behind him was Sammy Sosa with 66. We know they were both cheating. The next closest person, Ken Griffey Jr., was, was 50, uh, with, with 56. 14 home runs behind him, not four. 14 and then you see it just goes down it just trickles down everybody else is really close you got the real person that would have that would have been the home run leader that year um a little ahead of the next and then it just goes down and then it's just pretty normal from there but 70 66 and then he's a full 10 ahead of him the next person bro if you're cheating then somebody else the person if you're cheating and the next person that's, is, that's close to you is like super close it's a good likelihood that they're cheating too that's all we say and 2k has confirmed it and and if 2k said it happened then that's good enough for me because like i said they they got all the data man they know what's going on they know they can see everything so if they said it then it is what it is and we know that the game cheated so hey as far as i'm concerned you know, boom, you cheat. Hey, but look, no, don't worry about it. It's going to get your account back. Y'all are far enough ahead of everybody. Like, not even close. Nobody else is even close to y'all. But but he's cheating, and I'm completely legit. It doesn't add up to me when you say that. That's all I'm saying. Those pictures and those stats should be more than enough for anybody to be able to understand what I'm trying to say. And if you still want to say he ain't cheating, hey, maybe he's not cheating. It is what it is. But 2K said he's cheating. You're banned. It is what it is. It's a done daughter. And he, they probably still going to win the race anyway. But, hey, up next, man, we got your boy Joe Knows. He put out a tweet, a trolling tweet saying, ankle breakers are bite, baby. And at first I was like, oh, shoot, brute, we got to get out here and get on the court and see what's going on. And then I looked at it and it's 2K19. It's astonishing that it's a whole new park and we almost still can't tell these games apart, ain't it? That's crazy. He's on 2K19, not, not 20. This is 2K19. And it's crazy because you would think that with, don't y'all love these, these sweet transitions, man? You would think that this was 2K20, but it's 19. And I almost can't tell the difference between 21. Ain't that crazy? 21? Ain't that crazy? Anyway, man, hold on, hold on. Let's, let's jump back over here real quick. Smooth transition. We got, you know, we I had to show the stats real quick, man. But anyway, look, the whole thing is, I don't know what's crazier. The fact that Joe tried to get one over on us or that we can't tell the difference between the park that he's actually in and the now <laughs> It is what it is, though, man. I had to look at it again, bro. But yo, it is. It, it was. It was pretty dope, man. I think. I mean, I think it was funny, man. Uh, that you know, like I just didn't know which one was funnier. Y'all, let me know which is funnier. The fact that he said that they're back, and then he put it up with the screenshot, or the fact that we almost can't tell the difference between. You definitely can't tell that this 2K19 or 2K20. I don't think. Uh, yes, you can, because I guess the takeover is a little bit different. The takeover uh, joint was different, but. But you, you almost can't tell that this ain't 2K21. That's crazy. But anyway, man, last but not least, bro, um, Ronnie 2K gave out a um, Ronnie 2K gave out a logo, and this is one, this is one that warms my heart because um, you know he gave out a logo, and this is a guy named OJ Uncommon OJ, and Uncommon OJ. I mean Uncommon OJ. His name is OJ on the game. Uncommon Vision. He's a uh, he's a child. And he's disabled. And as y'all know, that's close to my heart because my child is disabled as well. Uh, LJ is autistic. 
Y'all don't know that. I don't put it out there. I don't try to be like, oh my God, I'm a child, I'm the father of an autistic child. And I'm trying to grind it. I don't do all this stuff, man. The only thing I do is I do what I got to do and uh, keep it going. But anyway, he gave out a logo to this fellow. He streams. He actually decent at the game. I'm not even going to lie to you. And, uh, you know, this is him. He just, he was talking, um, saying his thanks to Ronnie 2K. And uh, this is what it's really all about. And Ronnie says, I got free time with another. Running 2K, you you earned the hero of the day for this, and uh, let's let's listen to what Uncommon uh, what Uncommon Vision has to say. Hey there, Ronnie. I didn't really get a chance to properly thank you or chat with you or Mitchell while you guys were in my stream Friday, so I'll just do it here. First and foremost, thank you both for giving me a 2K logo. Never in my wildest dreams did I imagine myself getting something like this. I mean I knew Friday was logo day but, I didn't even see myself getting selected for one just because of my small social media presence, hell I wasn't even gonna stream on that day to be quite honest with you. But, I did, and the rest is history. Now we didn't get a chance to do a mini Q and day like you usually do with streamers when they get their logos, so, if either of you have time before the logo show goes to 2K TV, maybe you can stop by the stream and we can hoop and chat a little bit through Discord or something, or even through an Xbox Live party. Or, if you don't have any free time available, maybe DM me a few questions for me to answer and I'll record the audio, and send it back to you so you can use it on 2K TV. Just let me know if we can work something out because, just to keep it a hundred, I don't want to be known as just that disabled guy they gave a logo to, or, not that there's anything wrong with being one, some make a wish recipient. I have noticed a few people think that I am one and that's how I got a logo, but that's not the case, and again, there's nothing wrong with being a make a wish kid, I was one myself when I was a kid, I just want to make it clear that this logo was earned, not given. Well technically it was given to me by you guys and 2k but you know what I mean. I want people to know that behind this disability, is an intelligent, humorous individual who's hungry to be known for something other than what he cannot do. So yeah, Ronnie, Mitchell, again I say thank you for the logo, and let me know if we can work something out. Have a good Sunday evening and stay safe, peace. What an awesome and well-spoken young man, man. That that warms my heart. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all that this guy is not only stream is not only he got a logo, but he's streaming and he's grinding and he's putting forth the effort. Like he said, he wants to be known as a guy in the 2K community, a player that can play the game in the 2K community and not just you know uh, uh, you know not known for what he can't do. He want to be known for what he can do, and I can't do nothing but salute that because. If you if you know anybody with any type of disability, you know that's what it is. They don't want you to compensate for them for their disability. Hey, look, I can do what y'all can do. I just want you to respect what I can do. It's just like a fellow I play basketball with, a little dude named Will. He's an autistic cat. He's I can I can play. He's like, hey, look, I can play. I can do what I need to do. Just you know, give me the ball where I need to have the ball and stuff like that. And he ain't no different than nobody else. So it is what it is, man. Like I said, shout out to Ronnie for that. Uh, salute to him, and there's a lot more guys on on the list um, that were, you know, that that were people that that did make it, and they were like, uh, you know, he he did some stuff with a lot of other guys that were Make a Wish uh, people, but this was this was just one that uh, saw. That's my boy, Buddy Boy, right there. Come on, man, y'all already know Buddy Boy is that guy, man. But uh, you know, that's it, man. That's all I got for y'all, man. I wanted to take this thing out on a on a good note. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, man. And like I said, y'all let me know, have y'all been watching Crip Walking? Cause they, they look, man, they done closed app on my boy a couple of times. He, like I said, he played BP, took him and beat BP and didn't even have a great game and stuff like that. But like I said, even if he had a Cronus, it was just the icing on the cake because I ain't gonna lie, he been cooking this morning. Golly. And he, like I said, to get an open park, I done seen people play with Cronus since, since this thing came out and it really, they ain't been doing what he been doing. Even if so, even if he got one, you're not like he is. It's not going. It don't just make you good, man. That ain't what make him good. Him getting open and shooting jump shots 
and hitting his shots and stuff like that's what's making him good. It ain't like, like I, like I said, I've seen a few people with these cronies since, since it came out, and they are T double rash. I am not going to lie. But hey, this guy right here, crook walking, he is different. Boy, I ain't going to lie to you. Anyway, man, uh, that's all I got. <laughs> that's all I got for y'all today, man. Oh, and everybody, even if he is doing something, everybody in the stage is doing something because I didn't see him doing it. It just is what it is. They ain't even trying to hide it. That's why I watch the stage. It's like lions or gladiators in the lion den, and they doing anything that they can to survive for 2,500 VC. <laughs> it is what it is, man. I'm gone, man. I'm out of town next time. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Temp. Guys, baby.